Hello and welcome everyone to more nonsense and shenanigans in the world of Everhood. We are inside of our MMORPG and we are in the Badlands of Chaos, I think it was called. Give me a moment there, little buddy. I'm gonna take a look around here first. But you getting beaten to pop up there. Which I would suspect I need to help you with. But yeah, we are inside of the tabletop RPG right now. Okay. I gotta lie, it's kind of satisfying seeing you getting beaten there, but let's just... Stop hitting me! Only if you give me all of your items. Flan, is that you? Didn't you see? S didn't see? Ya. This is my custom made mech character from Gear Assault. This fantasy game is way easier with mech. I also noticed that attacking other players gives me more loot. This must be breaking several game rules. I'll have to take the rule back. Hold on. You play a good character, don't you, Red? Uh, uh -oh. In that case. And over all your items. I feel the wrath of chaos four. Sorry, six. <laughs> eh, I think green allows it. How? Oh. Okay, remember, we can reflect red attacks. They're in a stupid spot. Music's good. Again, as always with this, the music's some of the best stuff right now. Ooh. Oh, dang it, that was bad. Retry that one, please. We're not switching difficulty. Just because I got hit there once. Well, okay, actually, I got hit a few times, but that doesn't change. Me taking this challenge on. This was my first attempt into it. I really just wanna vibe to the music so hard. Just need to be sure to reflect the attack. I still wonder. Because at this point I still don't know if uh, you could technically just play the songs to an end. Or if they would just loop until you finish the fight or if they are like endless, endless tracks because I can also imagine them making tracks that are more endless but dang it I love that that track is really good well anyway there you go down with your mech stop attacking other players seriously not gonna help you up anymore this game is hard. I play a good guy, I lose. I play a bad guy, I lose. Here we go, I found the rule about PvP combat. Oh, I guess you guys solved it already. That was really not what we what we were concerned about. This show must go on, little one. I hope I have the voices correct. How am I supposed to win when I keep losing? What keeps telling me? Failure is the progress that paves the road to success, but to me failure just seems like failure. I guess I just have to think another way to, of another way to win the game. Maybe it's also not about winning the game all the time, huh? Hey bud. I can't believe I was steamrolled by Flynn. I should really retire, open an inn and become a merchant. Anything but a hero. Will you say sick? Still kinda enjoying you getting steamrolled there by Flan. Even if Flan is kind of a debug about it. Got a little bit too power hungry dead. Finally, at the foot of the tower, the lair of the evil wizard. Will you be able to save the village from its ill fate? This is actually becoming quite exciting. Who can do it, Red? I guess if anyone has a chance to win, it's you. If you defeat the evil wizard, we win the game. It's green. It's gonna be a self-insert character for the evil wizard. Why? You look cool. 
I am the cursed save point. There is a 50% chance that I delete your save. Lucky for you to have several save slots. <laughs> Do you take your chances? Oh, actually, I'm fine. A wise choice. I'm fine. I don't. I don't need. I don't need. I just started my recording sesh for this game. I'm here for at least 55 more minutes. Oh, that's that's an interesting way of doing that. That's cool. Ooh, atmospheric. From the looks of it, I think I'm going to face off with the Elite Four in an epic Pokemon battle. Uh, sorry, the champion of the Elite Four that is. Let's see what awaits us on the top. Hello! You have come a long way, warrior. I see that you are armed. See, I told you it's gonna be a self insert character. You are not the first they have sent to assassinate me. Isn't that right, Rasta Beast? Oh no! The villagers just fear what they don't understand, you see. Don't listen to the evil wizard, Red! Oh, shut up, Rasta! I don't have time for this. And you, heroes, are bothering me. Your death will serve as an example for anyone that would even consider disturbing me. I love how it just does that every time, every single time I love it. Anyway. I love the aesthetic of everything so much. Ooh. Oh, I see what the gimmick here is. Yeah, stupid shields block the attacks. Ah, so not everything will get through to you. Death is near! Ooh, we need to be careful. Ooh, no, don't die here. Ow, ow, ow. Don't play, don't play dumb games. I need you to play smart games. Oh, wrong side. You think you're fighting evil? I'm fighting you. You are so full of yourself. I am the one who hears God. Yeah, you're a little bit insane about it. But anyway... Ouch. I love this. The aesthetic, the way the fight went goes. Yes, he is. Oh, Arg! Arg! No fair. Two against one. Thanks, Rasta. Arg, I can't believe I was beaten by a wooden doll wearing a metal bucket. Sure. One day I will have my revenge. Arg. Thanks, Rasta. Not like I needed the help, but still, cool. Thanks for saving me, Brad. I wouldn't have made it if it wasn't for you. Let's go back to the village and tell them the good news. Yeah. Now that the quest has come to an end. Red and Rasta Beast journey back to the village, so lighted by a glorious sunset. Once returned, they were received as heroes oh, for defeating the evil wizard. Oh, that would have been amazing with the evil wizard. Glenn opened up a bakery where they sold slimy muffins. Which proved to be quite a success. Okay. Sig decided to make the tower their home, where Sig lived happily ever after, or at least for a long time. And Nosferat. Nosferatu. Wait. <laughs> Wait. We're, we're in the game at all? I wanted to roleplay as uh, one of the mushrooms. <laughs> Nosferatu continued the unfruitful quest of trying to learn the secrets of the past. Huh. Interesting. Quest completed. The end. Uh... 
So, what did you guys think? That was a good session, Green Mage. I played better. I enjoyed it as well, even if it was a bit hard. I guess this is it. Actually, we great efforts of saving the land of M Medallion Red. Oh, a door piece. Take this trip. Triple cha trip, trip you, Cherry. Piece of wood as a reminder of this epic quest. Oh, wow. I'm sure it will come in handy. Sure will. We picked up a piece of a door. The top piece of a blue door. Uh, that's just a large piece. Uh, let's head back to the cosmic hub. Well, actually. Can I not go back there anymore? Please let me go back there, because there's a way down now. Hey, uh, what are you doing? That is strictly private. Yeah, it's just so tight. You can't seem to get it open. Dang it. The villagers are eternally grateful for your courage, determination and strength to save the land of Medallion. Well, I guess it's finished. Good job. Sorry, bless you. What a great story! I'm glad we're finally able to finish the game. It seems like I have a hidden talent. You play as if it wasn't your first time. Definitely wasn't my first time. Well played, Red. It was quite an adventure. Two more to talk to. I thought the ending was disappointing. You got a tower out of it, so don't don't complain. Hi. You saved Medallion. I did. Okay. Well, that was fun. I still don't have toilet paper. I have a stick. And you want half used toilet paper. What was down there again? Because there was something down there. Door is locked. Only one lock now, though. Wasn't there two around that last time? When we checked it? Go get him, tiger. Thank you. Who are you? Mary Jane? So we're back in the hub. What about that green door far to the east? Won't let me talk to you. Um, that is where we started from. Or was that it? So you wanna go there. What is you? This place gives me the creeps. I know it's empty, but something feels off. Please let us leave, Red. No, no, no. There's, there's people here. I just want to be someone. I wish I could leave this place someday. So if we find these lost spirits, they come here. Good. Keep that in mind for later. A bit great time. Want to go back dancing? That's just that. It's a mushroom forest. Thought for a moment that we could really go out there. That's locked. Door is locked. What is it? Oh! No. No. Are we able to go over there? I want to go over there. Secret, secret! Green door it is, and okay. Shame, I wanted to go after the rabbit. <laughs> yes! Come again! Let's run! Nothing? Ooh. Ooh, interesting. So that's what you did to me. Sure. Sure. <clears throat> nope. 
Then I have to go up there. Why? Ah, okay, nothing there yet. I like it when this game goes so quiet because it's eerie. Stop right there, Red Hood! Oh, I have sent. I've been sent by Goldpick to stop you from reaching the cursed castle. I order you to stop your quest at once. Go back to where you came from, and I won't hurt you. I'm gonna resist. Nice fanfare, though. Call my bluff, huh? I won't bother you. There's no point in it. I know I won't beat you anyway. You're right, bud. I'll just tell Goldpick that you beat, beat me up. I hope I can count on you saying the same. Sure. Great, you're a cool guy. The castle over there is cursed, you know? It gives me the creeps just looking at it. You always seem to uh, stick yourself in bad situations. If you go in there and die, I could tell Goldpick I was able to get, get rid of you. So in any way, I shouldn't really stop you. I'm not so dumb after all. I mean, you're playing it smart. Work smarter, not harder, I guess. Just thinking that gold pig might be able to. Well, whatever. Do you want to ride the card? Sure. Is it gonna be more card mini games? Because that was fun. Cool. Oh! It kind of is. Oh! How interesting! Ow, so if I wanna make progress, I have to go back and forth, but I also have to. Whoop! Evade! Oh, I love this! First of all, the music's cool in this. Ow. But I like the idea behind that. Like, you have a simple thing to do, but it's gonna get made more. I should have maybe taken my time a little bit more. I was a little bit too good with what I did there. Anyway, address Secret entrance to the cursed castle. Mailbox property of Irvin. Irvin! I'm your mail. Let's go. Let's go here. Oh! Hello? This castle has a consciousness. Sometimes I hear it whisper. You're trying to find your arm. Red is also helping me. I see. That is kind of you. Maybe you are a kind person. You have a quest and you want to finish it. Everyone needs a purpose and yours is an, uh, is an understandable one. Sometimes, in the pursuit of the end, one might lose humanity. Make sure that you don't lose yours. Okay. Hey, I understand what he's talking about because uh, this whole thing is always about losing humanity. Okay. Just telling me the same thing again. Cool. Well. Thought there was gonna be something with you, but apparently not. Uh, it looks like there's a little bit more to the left there, so let's go right. Slime Co. It's you! Welcome to Slime Brothers Plank Service. My name is Slim, and my brother's name is Ma. That's me! We provide a plank retiring service. What kind of plank are you looking for? Give me a very long plank. Whoa! You know, very long planks are hard to handle. And they come with a price. Are you sure? Sure. Alright, matey. Actually, for you to rent a very long plank, you also need... Shoot, I forgot. Hey, Mark. Yeah! What do you need to rent a very long plank? You made a diploma of certification for handling very long planks? Right! Do you have a certification for handling very long planks? Yes. Hey, stop pulling my leg. You don't have a certificate. 
certificate. You're a funny guy. Of course you want one. Don't worry, it's on the house. Hey Mug! What is it, Flan? This boatface wants a diploma of certification for handling very long planks. Oh really? Get ready. Matey. I don't know why I need a lo very long plank. Um <clears throat> But it seems like I'm gonna get beaten over the head with a plank. Oh, dang it. Could have jumped with just pushing up. Ooh. Show me what you've got. Not to give you any ideas. I mean, what you're doing already sounds really good, but how about instead of just giving each other room to play for themselves? Why don't you play together? Hmm? Wouldn't that be a fun idea? Ouch. Stump. Jumped straight into that. There we go. Now they're doing a little bit of a combo thing. Still not a lot. Okay, that was cool. Yeah, I'm worthy of a diploma of certification of our handling very long planks. Damn, now it's up on the, on the wall. And of course, yeah, it's a very long plank. That does not feel very long, that just feels long. You picked up the very long plank. Very long plank, a sturdy long wooden plank. Seems quite durable, but a bit of a hassle to carry. Yeah, it's gonna be fine. Welcome back to Slimy Brothers Plank Service. Hope you're enjoying your plank. Sadly, we cannot afford to lend you any more planks. But let us know if you want some... Some jamming here. Not right now. No problem. See you around, matey. What do you say? Welcome to Slimy Brothers Plank Service. I saw you at the racetrack earlier. My name is Mac, and my brother's name is Slam. Talk to my brother if you want to rent a plank. The diploma reads... Diploma of certification for handling very long planks. The one who has earned this certi certification... Certificate has not only a master body of knowledge per se, uh, percent to handling very long planks, but also has demonstrated proficiency in wicked dance moves and an impeccable personal style, displayed in the medium of groovy beats. We, the Slime Brothers Plank Service, pres present with this diploma evidence that they have fulfilled all necessary requirements and is given with confidence that the individual is equipped by grace of Slime Brothers Plank Services. To meet their challenges in life as a strong, willful, and plank possessing individual. What a nice diploma! Please leave a diploma here. It's the only one they've got. Okay, sure. Now we have a very long plank. To what end? I do not know. Hey, bud! Hey, bud! Why can't anyone hear me? I did, though. Bye. Guess you're going to the place where the others are, huh? Hey, little fang. Oh, Freddy. Hey, ho, ha! Fancy seeing you here in such a spooky place. I am known as Freddy here. I've heard that this castle has a heart and a soul. I wonder what they re that really means. Maybe it has, a s it has secret rooms. I, I would suspect so. Hey, Rasta. The key to the locked door is somewhere in the maze. But it put I put it there. Maybe it was for the best. So I'm gonna have to go for a maze. Hi. A painting of a grey wizard hat. A broken painting, ripped in half. It seems to be a painting of a firestorm and lots of suffering. Okay. A painting of a city in the night. A painting of a lightning storm with a human shaped creature in the middle. Ah yeah, I can see that. A painting of a gnome silhouette with rainbow outlines. Yeah, I also see that. Cool. Oh, look who it is! Oh, it's you again! What the hell are you Do you want? Go be annoying... Be annoying somewhere else. I'm busy, can't you tell? I can feel you running through my veins. I'm not running. Now I'm running. So the castle just talked to me. Is that what I'm gathering from that? 
Okay. Run, 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 run. I'm gonna be up. Well, it's your veins. So running through them. Ooh. Oh, you have a very long plank. I assume you want to get to the maze. Try to be careful. That is not... That plank was way shorter when I picked it up. Give me a moment. So, and I'm back. Work-related calls. Anyway, we got over that. And I was... Uh, complaining that this plank was not as long when I picked it up. Anyway, let's move forward. Hey! I want you, Red. The maze monster lurks here. If it finds you, try to escape. It's relentless. That monster guard something. That was rude again. Sorry, I forgot what it was. A key, I would suspect. Oh! Oh, hi! This is my room. It ain't much. Bless you. Sorry. It would be nice if I had some more furniture. The game console with Super Racket inserted. Do you want to play some Super Racket with me? Sure, I have time in the episode. Okay. I warn you. I'm quite good. It was weirdly not okay for me. <laughs> that is not okay for me. I'm ready. Okay. I love this. Classic video game master. If you ever want to play again, I will be here. I want to play again. Oh. Bless you, you did not need to stand up for that. Yes. Yeah, you're quite good. That's gonna be... I do not like that. I do not like that. It's like the old Sega thing. I do not. I also do not like that. But I want to see because I want to hear a little bit more of the music here. Ah, I can't. So I have to hit all of these balls. So we're just gonna have to do that. So I did it first try, and there was nothing else to that. It's a shame, that's a good track. Well, a game console with super... Oh, it just says the same thing there again. Well! I like how you just teleport out here. So there's something creepy going on off screen. And I really want to know what it is. But I think I'm gonna keep that for the next episode. It means that this. Thank you. Shut it. it means that this episode is a little bit shorter. Shut it. I'm gonna come to you next time, in the next episode. So I hope you all enjoyed it, and see you then. Bye.